A frightening rampage on a packed plane from LAX to Boston. A man going on a terrifying rant and promising a bloodbath on board. And then I will kill every man on this plane. So where are they? Where's Homeland Security? Where are they diverting us? Because wherever it is, there's going to be a bloodbath everywhere. You can run away. You can all run away if you want. If you're men, you can run. I won't kill you. My fault is our You can put up your hands and say, don't kill me then, or don't approach me because I'm bald as our as renamed by God Baltar, since I'm taking over this plane. Oh my God. Uh -oh. Right now. Oh no. And then he steps into the aisle, holding something in his hand like a weapon. And moments later, he charges the front of the plane and stabs a flight attendant in the neck. <laughs> Other passengers and flight attendants quickly jumping into action, swarming the man and taking him down. That plane eventually able to land safely in Boston, where police were waiting to board that United Airlines 757 and take the man into custody. We're also learning more about what the pilots were doing during this mid-air emergency. Eyewitness News reporter David Gonzalez live at LAX, where that United flight took off from on Sunday. David. Mark, that suspect tonight is in federal custody, but as you just saw, it was a very scary ending for that nearly five hour flight from LA to Boston. And as you're about to see, things escalated very quickly after the flight attendants let the pilots know that he needed to land immediately because the suspect posed a threat to the plane. Because wherever it is, there's gonna be a bloodbath everywhere. Cell phone video aboard a United Airlines flight from Los Angeles to Boston Sunday, captured by a passenger and now part of a federal investigation, shows the tense moments leading up to a flight attendant being stabbed in the uh -oh. neck. Where's the Homeland Security with the gun? Because I'm waiting for them to point the gun at me so I can show everybody that I won't die when I take every bullet in that clip to wherever in my body they shoot it, and then I will kill every man on this plane. In the video, a Massachusetts man identified by investigators as 33-year-old Francisco Severo Torres is seen going on an alarming rant. Well, tell them to bring SWAT to shoot me down because they're going to have to shoot me down today. Torres has heard threatening other passengers and crews saying there will be a bloodbath. Video of the mid-air emergency captures Torres going into the aisle, holding something in his right hand. He makes his way toward the front of the plane where he swings at a flight attendant, allegedly stabbing him in the neck with a broken metal spoon. Several passengers quickly jumping into action and tackling Torres. Person is detained, uh, attempted uh, opening of an external door, emergency door. Uh, that person was subdued and is being detained right now. However, not going quietly, he's just laying there with six able bodies on top of him. This picture was snapped by a passenger after Torres was taken down and restrained. Investigators say the crew was notified 45 minutes before the flight was set to land that an emergency exit door between first class and coach had been disarmed a quarter of the way. A flight attendant had seen Torres near the door and confronted him. Torres allegedly asked if there were any cameras showing he had tampered with the door. Shortly after is when the recording of the disturbing incident began. In a statement, United Airlines says, we have zero tolerance for any type of violence on our flights, and this customer will be banned from flying on United pending an investigation. It is important to point out as well that the flight attendant who was attacked was not seriously hurt. The FAA and the U.S. Attorney's Office is investigating, and right now, Torres is facing an interference, an attempted interference with the flight using a dangerous weapon. If convicted, he faces up to life in prison. Reporting live from LAX, David Gonzalez, ABC7 Eyewitness News. All right, David, thank you. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.